Hey, another unboxing video of uh, Funko Pops, because I don't have anything else right now. So, uh, you know, today was Target Con, which I really don't understand what it is. I mean, they just drop a couple of pops on one day and they call it Target Con. <laughs> and then, I mean, I don't know. But before that, before I get into it, Hit that like button below, subscribe to the channel, and give me your thoughts. What do you think of Tari Khan? So, I was debating on whether to go to bother going to Tari Khan, because I had looked it up. The only things I saw was... Uh, the only thing that really interested me was the Michael Jordan one that I saw. And then I saw that it wasn't even a Target exclusive. So I was like, eh, I'll pick it up wherever. But I figured, you know what, there's a Target that by me that I wanted to check out to see what their selection was because, you know, I just started collecting pop, so. And the selection in places I've gone has been very varied. Yeah, the couple, of, yeah, like the target, the couple of targets I've gone to haven't had a ton of pops. You know, they have like one uh, shelf. I mean, multiple shelves, but not. And they're usually cleaned out. You know, they don't stock them that often. And like uh, I, I posted on Instagram that the Walmart was a bust. They had like 20 pops combined. So... I went to two Walmarts and they had like, I mean, maybe 30 pops combined. It was ridiculous. And it was super Walmart. So I don't, but so I think I'm going to stick to, uh, if there are Walmart exclusives that I want, I'll buy them online and not deal with going, because they're not, they're kind of out of the way too, but so anyway, I I decided to go to the Target, a different Target by me that I didn't haven't gone to for to look at pops yet. So I went there just to check it out. There, you know, I was planning like. Okay, maybe I'll get the Michael Jordan one if they have it. But I just wanted to see what their selection was like. Their selection wasn't great. I mean, they had... You know, they had some pop, but like like the other target, they're sort of cleared, cleared out. They have like some shell. The shelves go like four pops deep. But some of the shelves only had one row of pops, so it's not. Uh, and they weren't really they weren't really exclusive for anything that I wanted or felt that I couldn't get when they were on sale somewhere. Because like all the exclusives, they had multiples of them, so. But, uh, so this is what I picked up. Sorry about the noise. Probably should have taken it out beforehand. But I picked up 
I ended up picking up the Michael Jordan one. So, you know, it's kind of a big one, but I like it'll be a good display piece eventually. And I also picked up this one, the thing, to Target exclusive. And I was only going to pick up the Michael Jordan one, but I need to put that down. But um, I uh, was looking up because, you know, they were charging 30 bucks for each one. And I didn't really want to spend 30 bucks on a non-exclusive unless it was already, unless it was already like shot up in value. So I looked on the Funko app and it's already at $37. So I was like, I'm going to get it because it may be just that everyone's buying it and there won't be any more because you never know. Like, because there are common pops that are worth a lot of money. So, and I think a lot of the Michael Jordan ones are, have shot up in value. So I think the, you know, I, I don't think it's, uh, common to see an older Michael Jordan pop that's not uh, a lot, no, more than uh, what you would have paid for it. So, the, and then when I was looking on the app, I saw that the thing is now worth $55. So I was like, oh, I better get this because, you know, maybe it'll go down in value, but it's an exclusive, it's a Target exclusive. So hopefully they don't just keep producing them and then flooding the market, but hopefully. So I figured it was a good one to get. You know, I like being that I like Marvel, it's not like I didn't want this one. It's just that I didn't necessarily want to pay $30 for it when it's, you know. But I ended up doing it because of the value. And I, I was thinking about the Kool-Aid Man, but being that it's also a 10-inch pop, it's big. It's wider than the other, than these. I, you know, I just felt like that eh, it's not really necessary. So, let me pause the video, get these out of the boxes, and show you guys. Hold on. <laughs> 